a lot of teams have questions in HubSpot when it comes to reporting, particularly around sources. So we're going to quickly take a look at how to investigate where are your sources, what are some of the information that's being captured on sources, because it's not always readily available. So first thing we're going to do, I'm in the new HubSpot report builder. I'm just looking at my contacts as a data source, no additional data sources. I'm going to search for original source here, and I'm going to go ahead and add both original source, drill down one and drill down two to my report. These are now fields I can use. I'm also gonna go ahead and add a filter. Because to start, I'm just gonna look at my direct traffic. So our direct traffic is our filter here, hit apply. And then we're gonna also include account of contacts, okay. So now I'm going to say original source, let's chart our number of contacts, should only show us direct traffic since we added that filter. Let's go ahead and see how it does. All right, there's my direct traffic number like I was expecting. And now I'm going to add an additional row of our drill down. So now I can take a look and see, all right, everything is direct traffic we know, but this is where this is the drill down one. This is actually capturing the page that they were on, um, you know, that direct traffic is being attributed to. So, you know, all this is coming from our website, but you can take a look at what are the pages that are actually driving um, some of that direct traffic. Another easy way to kind of look at this is if we change our filter from direct traffic to say organic social, let's see what we get. All right, there we go. So same thing, it's gonna break it out by our social. It's just a much easier way to kind of take a quick look, um, but a lot you can do with these reports. You can throw them onto charts. Um, I was using this pivot table as an example, um, but the new builder really has a lot more capabilities when it comes to being able to group and segment and look at this information a variety of different ways. It's not a full analytics tool, but it's definitely heading that direction.